Hey guys, my name is Fahad and welcome back to another video of Gatroid ROMs. Today in this video we are gonna review another interesting custom ROM which is the Evolution X as you can see here and this is the latest and official build of Evolution X for our Redmi Note 8 and its version is 5.4 Boombastic official build. Its Android version is latest Android 11. Security patch is also the latest 5 February uh, 2021. So today in this video we're gonna review it out, we're gonna talk about uh, it, its uh, performance, stability, battery life, gaming performance and all about it. So without any further ado, let's get started. Evolution X is one of my favorite custom rooms because its uh, stability, performance, Everything is just out of uh, words. Everything is just awesome. So first of all, let's talk about this launcher. In the launcher, we have this uh, basic launcher. Then we have widget styles and wallpapers. In the styles, uh, we have five styles, maybe six styles. You can create your own by clicking on the custom button. You can change the grid and you can get the wallpapers right from here. Here we have some live wallpapers pre-installed. But if you want this uh, beautiful wallpaper, then check the link from the description and now uh, have a look on the camera we got it in this room uh, here is the camera this is the simple camera but don't worry you can install any gcam mode from by watching my previous videos i also made a video on the latest uh, gcam 8.1 which uh, which is working pretty much fine and it is coming with all the new features from the pixel devices so you can have it by watching my previous video after it the overall performance and the app opening speed of this rom is also pretty much good as you can see here it is opening the applications quickly there is no any single bug or lag or issue in this rom everything is just working smoothly and uh, the gaming performance of this rom is also pretty much good uh, the gfs are uh, pre-included in this rom so don't need to uh, install the gfs ma uh, manually as you can see here we have the all necessary Google applications pre-installed and uh, then we have the quick settings here we have a lot of shortcuts you can add more by editing it as you can see here here we have a massive range of shortcuts now let's dig into the settings and talk about its uh, customizations so first of all we have the network and internet connected devices the in evolver uh, in the evolver we have all available customization and this room has a really good range of customizations first of all we have the theme options from here you can change the dark theme you can change the cloak style for your uh, lock screen then you can change the ascent color then you can change the font style you can change the icon shape status bar icon style you can change the style of uh, volume panel right from here then we have the custom header option you can enable uh, it and you can also add any static image or you can also apply any collection right from here and it looks pretty much cool after it we have a status bar in the status bar you can manage the clock and date battery bar then we have the status bar battery indicator you can change the style percentage etc icon manager and some other icon settings then we have quick settings notifications power menu you can also enable the advanced reboot right from here and uh, you can also enable some options like uh, screen record screenshot and hide on screen uh, lock screen then we have the gestures from here you can manage the OSIP gestures first of all we have the quickly open camera system navigation bar here we have three button nav bar two button nav bar and gesture navigation bar in the gesture nav bar we have some advanced settings like you can ma ma uh, manage the back sensitivity uh, you can hide the pill or you can adjust the length bar of pill you can enable the haptic and you can also disable the back gesture animation then we have prevent ringing swipe three fingers with screenshot power menu switch screen off skip music track and adaptive playback after it we have screen off power button torch and you can manage the brightness right from here and then we have double tap gestures which is working fine then we have lock screen settings 
uh, after it we have the navigation bar settings hardware button settings and animation settings and in the misc we have advanced gaming mode and some other settings after it we have the battery the battery performance of this rom is just awesome and uh, here we have the battery saver you can also enable the extreme battery saver then we have the smart charging which is working fine so you can you no need to install any custom kernel to enhance the battery life because the uh, battery life is already awesome so then we have the sound the sound quality of this rom is also pretty much good uh, you can make changes you can enable the live captions you can adapt you can enable the adaptive sound you can manage the vibrations and the sound quality is pretty much good because we have the Xiaomi uh, Mi sound enhancer in the Xiaomi parts and uh, after the sound we have storage, privacy, location, security in the security we don't have the face unlock but the fingerprint and on screen locks are working pretty much good so uh, after it we have uh, accounts, accessibility, digital well-being, google, xiaomi parts in the xiaomi parts we have Mi sound enhancer then we, uh, we have the Xiaomi Dose, Display Collaboration, Color Collaboration, Clear uh, Speaker and you can also enable the USB fast charging when you are connecting your phone uh, with your PC or a laptop. Then we have the system. In the system we have languages and input, gesture, data time, backup, rules, reset options, multiple users and system update. And at the end we have the about phone section. In the about phone section, you can check the Android version of this ROM is uh, latest 11. Uh, the Evolution X version is 5.4, Boombastic official build, and its security patch is 5 February 2021. So the ROM is pretty stable. There is no any single bug or issue. Every single thing is just working fine. Recommended for daily usage, recommended for gaming, and. Uh, how you can install it just download the rom from the link in the description and just reboot your device into any installed custom recovery so after going into the recovery uh, i recommend you to delete the uh, previously installed custom rom to remove your old custom rom you need to go into the wipe click on advanced from here select everything except the internal storage and sd card do not select the internal storage and sd card wipe right from here after wiping go back to home click on install now locate your downloaded rom mine is in the uh, let me select the storage mine is in the idm compressed and here uh, we have it let's click on it and flash right from here do not uh, flash the gfs and if you want to root your rom you can flash the magics manager and if you want to decrypt your storage then you can also flash the disable dm write zip file you can download all the files from the link in the description after flashing these files click on reboot click on reboot system and within a few seconds or one or two minutes uh, the rom will be installed on your redmi note 8 so look look at the animations it's pretty much beautiful and cool so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon for future updates uh, keep supporting thanks for watching peace